You know, I, I got to tell you, Doc. You know, I discuss cases involving the the QRS and its outcome, and probably the one. That, and I've told you about the the old lady with the with the torus pelvis and this and that. But the the most dramatic of recently has to be the foot drop, and the patient was already wearing an AFO an AFO device, and uh, and they had tried a, a multitude of medicines in order to help diminish the the effect of the non-working traumatized nerve, and. Everything demonstrated that the nerve was still intact. It was just that during at some point in the surgery, she had it traumatized, but she was not getting the response and couldn't walk, couldn't drive her own car. This was her right foot, her driving foot. And so in the back of my mind, as I gave her the device, I said, you know, this is going to be a pretty good test because she didn't respond to conservative management. She didn't respond to meds. She didn't respond to even a, a an extended acupuncture um, trial. This device? She brought it back into me, and she was she walked in, and I couldn't have believed the smile on her face and the fact that she drove herself, and the husband didn't have to, the husband didn't have to bring her in for her care. It changed her life because they're foster parents, and they've had dozens of children under their care over the years. And the last thing she would ever have, would she would would really have changed her life would have been her, in her inability to take care of these little ones and her inability to get around and. And it really did make a difference, and I'm going to continue its use. I can't tell you enough how much not only I appreciated it for my patients, but the patients themselves have appreciated the outcomes that have been seen now with the QRS. i got to tell you, I'm happy with it.